Charles Oliveira versus Kobe Covington could be next. As Charles Oliveira said that he's down to fight Kobe Covington. Who do actually win this fight? Well, before we talk about who to win this fight, let's take a look at their latest performances in which Charles Oliveira fought Benio the Roost, in which Charles Oliveira TKO'd him in round one. Oh, he's been done! It's over! Defending. It's over! Charles Oliveira! At this, Charles Oliveira wanted to fight Armand Sarukin at UFC 300, in which Armand Sarukin had a lot of ground control, outlanded Charles Oliveira, and got out of two Tyson missions, in which obviously Armand Sarukin ended up taking it by decision. For the winner, by split decision, Let's take a look at Kobe Covington's latest performances in which he fought Jorge Masvidal, a very close fight, both went back and forth, both fired some great shots and kicks in which Kobe Covington got rocked in round 4. That's nice. Oh! But still managed to outland Jorge Masvidal and ended up taking it by decision. By unanimous decision, Kobe! At this, Kobe Covington went out to fight Leon Edwards, in which Kobe Covington did trash throughout the whole entire fight, got out landed by Leon Edwards, and Leon Edwards won almost every single round, and Leon Edwards ended up taking it by decision. And still, the undisputed... Now, before I talk about this fight with Charles Oliveira and Kobe Covington, let me talk about some interesting things that Charles Oliveira has been saying, and that is that not only did he say he's willing to fight Kobe Covington, but he said he's also willing to step in as a backup for Conor McGregor versus Michael Chandler at 170. So it seems like Charles Oliveira has seen reality, and that is that he's very far away from getting a title shot in the lightweight division. And that is simply because he already lost to Armand Sorokin, so if anything, Armand Sorokin is going to get a title shot before he does. So I think it's best for him to go out to 170 and try and test himself. So now, does Charles Oliveira stand a chance with Kobe Covington? Well, I do believe so, because based off Kobe Covington, his latest performance it doesn't make him look good in this situation and the fight being boring is one thing but the fact that he got outperformed by leon edwards is another thing and the fact that leon edwards did not look great for what kobe covington had to offer just makes me believe that charles Oliveira is ready for this fight whether it comes to striking or whether it comes to grappling and if kobe covington's biggest weapon in this fight is his cardio and his aggressive wrestling where well, he better show it because based off charles Oliveira's last fight it seems like he's ready for a high paced fight so in the end i believe charles Oliveira, even at 170 will be able to hang with kobe covington and even outperform him so i got charles Oliveira winning this fight and pretty convincingly.